is one of the worst spots for foreclosure in the entire Southwest. Today, abandoned homes in Valencia County were the focus of a tour for a number of state officials. It let them see firsthand how bad the problem is. News 13's Jeff Todd is here with more. Kim, the first ever statewide summit for code enforcement kicked off today in Berlin. It brings together public and private companies as well as residents to talk about problems and come up with better solutions. They boarded the bus, and once it was rolling, the view wasn't very good. Vacant homes and empty apartment buildings littering the streets of Berlin. Police officers, wow, they would be here three, four, five times a day. It's uh, in a response to the nationwide epidemic of foreclosures that we have. You know, we can't just have these properties vacant. Multifamily apartments go through foreclosure just like uh, individual residences, but they're worse because they leave so many people behind, and they also invite uh, the criminal element oftentimes in there. But they would uh, come out here and openly sell drugs. Berlin and Valencia County have been the epicenter for problems with empty buildings and crime. But the tour also showed off places like this. A former apartment complex that was abandoned is now being restored in an environmentally friendly way. And I think it's a big importance, a big boost to uh, the economy most likely, but you know, you have a boost uh, with the people, with the neighbors. It's not just about board ups, it's not just about evicting people, but we're also looking at how do we help people out. Organizers of the summit hope the problem and answers in Valencia County can influence change throughout the state. The goal is to reach into every community that's having the same issues we're having all throughout rural New Mexico and be a resource and be, be there to back them up. Organizers hope they're at the forefront of this issue, but over the past year, 90-day mortgage delinquencies have nearly doubled throughout the state, meaning the foreclosure crisis could be far from over. Kim? Okay, thanks, Jeff. Now, one of the reasons the rural areas of New Mexico are seeing more of a problem is because most don't have dedicated code enforcement officers or the resources like big cities such as Albuquerque do.